Yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Dr. Tan, that was, that was exciting. This is really a, an exciting day for South Carolina. And I know it's an exciting day for Walmart, Mr. Foran, and all of you here. It looks like the whole town of Ridgewood's here. But uh, this is uh, Ridgeburg, Richburg. But let me get this straight. How about that? We do love Chester. Y'all, this has been exciting. I've been in this office for uh, just not, not quite a year, and before that in the Lieutenant Governor's office and the Attorney General's office before that, but I'm a lifelong resident of South Carolina, except for one year working for the Honorable J. Strom Thurmond in the United States Senate, a, a, a very great man. And it was up there that I happened to meet my wife, Peggy. Peggy, stand up and say hello to the people, please. <laughs> Peggy Jean, straight from Spartanburg. But this is a, this is a great partnership. Uh, two, two great companies, GT and Walmart. It just doesn't come any better than that. And to have Walmart's Made in America program uh, as a leader, a world leader, in a thought leader, an industrial leader, a commercial leader, to have Walmart committed to such a program is, is really a, a great thing, not only for this state, but for the for the whole world. But I got to say, uh, we've been had so much excitement with plants and businesses expanding and growing and coming into South Carolina that it's, uh, it's been real rewarding to feel the excitement and see the growth and see the promise that this spells for this great state, which has such a long history going back to 1670. But today is the day of brain power. Today is the day of thinking. And Dr. Tan, what you were saying is exactly right. It's, it's IT, it's all those things that never existed before. And Doug and I was speaking about how the steam engine changed the world, and now the computer chip is changing the world. And these two companies, GT and Walmart, are as good a strong example of that kind of combination, that kind of forward thinking and brain power as, as any that we have in the country. We have in South Carolina three great research universities that want to work with companies like yours. We have a great port. It, before long, the Port of New York and the Port of New Jersey will be the biggest, most, uh, the biggest uh, and most active ports on the Atlantic coast. We have the best technical college and workforce development community in the United States. We've got plenty of power, we've got great weather, and most of all, we have great people. And there's been so much excitement. I've had people come up and ask me, I want to serve in the government. I want to be a part of all this. I said, well, where do you think you'd fit? I said, they say, well, pro probably in your cabinet. I said, well, where, where do you think you would fit best in the cabinet? He says, well, do you have a liquor cabinet? That might... <laughs> but we do want to get people involved. We do want to get people thinking. We're all looking for ideas. Politics is nothing more than a, a search for better ideas. And ladies and gentlemen, I have to say that the, the, the ingenuity, the innovation, the strength, the determination that is exemplified by these two companies, GT and Walmart, is just off the scale and can't be beat. So we, we are delighted to have this combination here. We're delighted to have these two great companies here in South Carolina partnering with this Made in America program. And we want to keep it going. We want to keep going to the top because by going to the top with economic prosperity, that solves so many other problems. Happy people are a great, a great thing. So as was said to close, to, to quote that great philosopher also known as a country western singer, Tim McGraw. I like it, I love it, I want some more of it. So bring it on, and thank you.